so here is the other world that makes martial arts talent, Khabib Nurmagomedov, and there's so much made about his value as a corner man. Tonight, though, he is competing and has Bulas in his corner. Yeah, Coach Khabib is as undefeated as fighter Nurmagomedov compete again. This guy is the definition of pressure. He is trying to take you down, and he does not hide his intentions. He wants to get in your face, he wants to take you down, and he wants to drown you. This guy is a savage, he's a beast. Every word that describes that is Habib Nurmagomedov with a bull in his corner. Martial arts. I guess everybody except the Eagle, Khabib Nurmagomedov, impossibly difficult to get this guy off of you once he takes you down. How do you prevent that from happening is the question for the opponent tonight. Just missed with that right hand. Come on, better defense, better defense. Get that right hand up. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Oh, was that a switch kick? It's such a beautiful technique and done the right way. The one-two punch is true. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times, people throw single ball. Oh, powerful double leg takedown. Nice entry on that attempt. Well, how's that for executing the game plan? He told us he needed to get the... Look at him, he's setting up the choke now. Look at that, he's setting it up. Oh, tense moment here. That arm triangle's tight. Oh, somehow, some way he got out. These guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. This is where he wants to be. All right, working on the ground here, his opponent's feet on the hips. And he's able to work his way back to his feet. Got the single collar tie. Look at the investment that this young man is making to the body with those strikes. And now some separation. Good shot there to land the takedown. Nice job by Nermago Meadow. Beautiful jab there by the champ. Midway through round one. Nice move in the half guard. Shades of Daniel Cormier slicing through that guard. Unbelievable. I love it. Like a knife through butter. What a great job passing. And now he's inside the chair. That was a slick transition. That Dorse is tight. That's the mission. All right, he continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Well, defense doesn't always win championships in MMA, but how about the submission defense tonight thwarting one attempt after the next? Yeah, and the fact that he's just constantly under attack tells you he was very prepared for the type of fighter that he was in front of. He knew there would be some submissions coming his way. He was ready to defend them, and he has done that beautifully. Khabib's got the full mount. Big ground and pound. All right, late round action here. Khabib Nurmagomedov continuing to dominate the action. Beautiful transitions, and I'm not sure anybody mixes their wrestling and their grappling as well as this guy. I mean, he's just so tough. He's willing to go through the fire in order to get the fight to the ground. He's been able to do that. He is one of the strongest fighters I have ever grappled with. The guy has tremendous strength, but it's not just the strength, it's the technical skills on the ground that has allowed for him to separate himself from the rest of the lightweight division. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Oh, he's got the single collar locked in the clinch now. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, how good was that combo? He is really doing a nice job stringing his shots together now. 
Oh, single collar tie here. And there's another takedown attempt. Back in the clinch. Look for him to hang on his opponent's head. He trying to wear at his gas tank. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. They're so evenly matched, they're going to the test. Oh, he slipped that strike and then countered beautifully, really starting to get his range and get into a good flow on the feet as the ball goes by. Well, that combination's gonna test his chin. Yes, he did. 15 seconds remain in the round. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. There's the shot. There's another takedown by Nermago Metal. Constantly a moving target. Second round, straight ahead. All right, man, this is it. This is the last round. You're losing this one. You need to go out there, out hustle this guy, put the pressure on him. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Second round underway. All right, next round is underway. Defense doesn't win championships, but I know you liked what you saw out of him fighting off of his back there in the previous round. Well, you can't be on your back just getting brutalized. And he did a fantastic job of limiting the damage from the bottom. Was able to control his opponent's posture. Was able to throw up a couple submissions to keep the opponent on high alert. He just did a good job of being very aware of everything that was coming at him when he was in the bottom position. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Get the hands going here early. That was a nice transition. That was right off the strike into the takedown, and it looked effortless. It did not look like he had to work hard to finish the takedown at all. Uh, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. That Darce is tight. Elbow. And he's back to his feet. Good side for him there. All right, so another takedown for the wrestler. He hinted that he wanted to strike here tonight, but sticks with the bread and butter, and it's working. The bread is buttered, so why would you not eat it? This guy is doing exactly what we have come to expect from him. He goes forward, he level changes, and he takes you down. Once you're on the ground, he grinds you out. This is a wrestler's calling card, and he is showing you why tonight in the octagon. Oh, nice land there by Nermako Metup when he made his... Oh, nice double leg, yes. Yep, and he's got him secured in the half guard now. Nermako Metup's back in half guard, very comfortable here. All right, side control now, DC. You know, oh, looks like he's trying to isolate an arm, maybe set up a Kimura here, DC. He's attacking the Kimura. Defense holds up, he gets out. He said that he was ready for everything that would be thrown at him. In that position, he showed that and proved it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, back up again, you can't hold a good man down. Now some uppercuts. He better move, John. He cannot take these uppercuts from this position. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up here. Nice pass. This is where you don't want to be, though. Nice transition. Great ground and pound by this man. And there it is. Another strike on the ground gets through. Nermago Medov's in half court. Uh, watch the yard. This yard bar going up. Oh, that one looks really tight, DC. Back and forth we go. This might be it, though. This cannot happen much longer. Oh, he's out. He actually escaped. Look, I gotta stop writing these dudes.
these obituaries, man. I always think they're done. Surprise me. 90 seconds to go now. Oh, shades of the Godfather with the ground and pound Mark Coleman as he lands again. Holy somewhere smiling watching this guy land from the top position. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Establishing the jab. He clinches now. Straight punch is true. Well, Javier Mendez, Tony Johnson, all the guys at AKA gotta like what they're seeing out of Khabib Nurmagomedov striking here early, DC. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Ooh, that Kimura looks tight. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You gotta figure out a way to get back to your feet. He needs to shove the knee, hip heist, and get back up to your feet. Beautiful ground strike landing. Man, another one lands. He's trying to pound his opponent's head through the canvas. Oh, right to the mouth. Seconds winding down in round two. Oh, All right, round three oh. coming up next. All right, so that's the end of the round. A lot of highlights from which to choose, but his success in that round certainly rooted in his offensive takedown game. And that's what he does, right? He's a grinder. He's the type of guy that wants to get a hold of you, drag you to the floor. It doesn't bother him that much if you get back to your feet. He just wants to continue to make you work the entire time because he understands this type of grind most guys can't keep up with. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Stop. All right, so not enough action there on the ground. The referee brings the fight back to the feet, and we are back underway. Checks that leg kick. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. All right, half guard position here. Gotta watch his neck. Ooh, this could be it. That thing is tight. That arm triangle is deep. <laughs> Great submission to Benjamin. Full display work. by the opponent. And he is back up to his feet. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there. And offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent, not being able to hit the guy that really put away. But that's a testament to the head and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. You gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Nermago Medov gets another takedown. Largely, he's a striker, but the wrestling is there tonight. Got his guard pass. Khabib's back in half guard. Getting them out here. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Oh, now he's attacking the arm triangle. Oh, looks like he's got that arm pinned in the triangle now. Oh, gives up on the submission now. We'll see where it goes from here. I know you've got a huge appreciation for this. Oh, I mean, this is this is high-level grappling by both of these guys. 
Nurmagomedov going to work here from the full guard. Nice combination of strikes, mixing it up pretty well here. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Less than two minutes to go in round three. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, nice punch from the clinch by Nermago Meadow. On the shot. There you go, single leg. Just misses with the jab there. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Nice jab. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not had any answer for these body shots, and now you see the visible damage. Well, his coaches are wondering, where's the defense? We worked on this. We knew this would be an attack that they would come with. Why are you not doing what we've trained? He's got to change something, man. He's got to tuck that elbow. He's got to roll and turn. He cannot continue to take these body shots. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. He's landing upside his opponent's head over and over again. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round here, DC. That could be pretty useful when it comes to the scorecards, potentially. Very useful when it comes to the scorecards, but also a testament to his conditioning and his cardio to still be throwing takedown attempts at the end of rounds instead of when he's fresh. Oh, caught him with the head kick. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Didn't see that one coming. Gets tagged in a nice combination for the head. Both fighters throwing heat now. All right, that's three rounds in the books. We are headed to the championship round. All right, so there's the horn. That means it's the end of the round, and a lot of good offensive wrestling work from him over those previous five minutes. I mean, great offensive wrestling. Every time he changed levels and got to his opponent's legs, he was able to secure the takedown. Let's see what type of fatigue his opponent will carry into the next round. All right, let us now look back at some of the highlights from that round, and there just aren't that many guys on this roster that can keep up this offensive wrestling pace over 15 or 25 Ready. minutes. But he's one of those guys. Good. He is one of those guys that's able to continuously take you down, even if you get up over and over. He has this ability to maintain that pace and pressure that he can wear his opponents down. That's why you see him get so many finishes as the fight progress. All right, doing work with the jab. right hand by the yeah, yeah. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Nirmago Medov gets hit hard with that overhand. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Well, the most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. And at times in the past, maybe you could say he's been a headhunter. But tonight, he has worked the body to great effect. And those are really starting to take their toll. And now he's a tip and choke. Oh, he's got it locked in. He's got that arm triangle deep. Holding the position, still working for a submission. It's painful. That's got to be it. And there it is! Coming up huge tonight. <laughs> oh, man. So what a win for...
for him here tonight. He gets it done and gets it done by way of submission. He told us this week, I got to keep these judges out of it. Mission accomplished. Absolutely. He is a phenomenal grappler. He said that he held the advantage there, and that would show itself in the fight. He proved that, and he gets a submission victory. Amazing. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 20 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by submission due to an arm triangle choke. And still, the undisputed USC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle, Nevada Meda. All right, you heard it there from Bruce Buffer, Khabib Nurmagomedov, your winner by submission here tonight.